కేంద్ర ప్రభుత్వం తీసుకొచ్చిన ఇన్స్టిట్యూట్ ఆఫ్ టీచింగ్ అండ్ రీసెర్చ్ ఇన్ ఆయుర్వేద బిల్ ను తాము స్వాగతిస్తున్నామన్నారు టీఆర్ఎస్ ఎంపీ కేశవరావు బిల్ పై రాజ్యసభలో చర్చ సందర్భంగా ఆయన మాట్లాడారు సాంప్రదాయ వైద్యంపై ఫోకస్ చేయడం మంచి పరిణామం అన్నారు వేలాది సంవత్సరాలుగా మన ఆరోగ్యం ఆయుర్వేదంపై ఆధారపడి కొనసాగుతోందన్నారు Besides in that state, we have Tibi, Yunani, Umapati, Naturopathy, besides Siddha. Siddha is borrowed from Tamil Nadu. Tibi and Yunani had a royal patronage in those days. So I welcome any move that focuses on research and education, particularly in the field of traditional knowledge, which played immense role in the past sustaining human life and science of life for ages. Sir, Ayurveda belongs to us. So that is our interest. It is our traditional wealth. the thousand years of our lives and health are sustained by it and its systems it has six recognized systems which i need not go but but since they have referred ayurveda siddha yunani yoga naturopathy and homeopathy what distinguishes ayurveda is its well defined conceptual framework that sustained it for ages it promotes living in harmony with universe modern medicine though recognizes the harmony as the crux of health care have not taken care of this in particular but surprisingly not surprisingly the who concept of health is in close approximation with the concept of health defined by ayurveda sir ayurveda is catching up with the global acceptance it is slowly becoming a part of mainstream medicine in the world particularly in the dietary matters ayurvedic products amounted to nearly 3.4 billion dollars which is expected to triple to 9.7 billion by the year 2022 a growth of 16.2% The sale of Ayurvedic products is expected to raise to $8 billion by 2022 from $2.5 billion in 2015.